Okay children, today we are going to see the second term. As you have already finished the first term, all the children have written your exams very well. And like that, we are going to start the second term, Unit 1, Ancient Excavations. Okay, so go through this lesson children, what all we have learned today, go through this as per the schedule. Now, Ancient Excavation. In this lesson, we are going to learn what do you understand about the excavation and know about the archaeologists and to get knowledge about some archaeological sites. What do you mean by the excavation? Excavation is digging the earth. And the earth is what we are getting the remains of the past that is previous day. Past history of the people, Parangala Mani Dargal, Avargal, Ubiyakupatkana, Purulgal, Avanga Varanda, Yedha, things they have used, everything it is buried under the earth. Sometimes if they dig the earth and the things and all we can recover and we can see the people, what type of people live there and uh, what they have used, how they live and all we can learn. So that is known as the excavation, digging the earth and know the remains of the past. And then archaeologist, what do you mean by the archaeologist? is a person who learns about the human history. Manisha Nudia, the previous man is the animal only. After that, Koncha Koncha Maa developed. Manisha Nama, they invented, we are seen in the early civilization also. They have developed one by one because in the ancient days, people lived in forest only. They don't have the light, current, everything. Step by step only, they find out everything. So, uh, archaeologists, the archaeologists studying about the human history, how the humans lived in the past, where they lived, what they eat, uh, and how they developed their habits and everything. Okay, that is the archaeologist. So, in this, it's a conversation, small conversation between Reka and Grandma. Reka, it is so hot today. I do not think that I can go out to play. What grandma is telling? Ha, ah, very true. But when I was young, I used to play outdoors all the time. Nowadays, it's very hard means oh, no one, the children won't go outside and play. So that what she Reka is telling to her grandma. But what grandma is telling? When she was young, she used to play outside only, outdoors only. How did you play when it was hot? So Rekha is asking, if it is too hot, means how can you play in the hot? She is asking. Or grandma says, when I was young, our neighborhood was full of trees and I used to play under the shade of the trees. In those days, there are so many trees are there, buildings is not much. So there's got a shades under the tree. So Nariya Marangal is shade. So the Marangal is shade. But nowadays there is no trees, only the buildings and houses, they have been constructing the houses. So there is no trees or shade anything. So it seems to be very hard. If there is a tree, the heat and all will take from the tree and we got the shade. Wow, really? I wonder how people live in those days. So on the the people every day and she is really, she is wondering. Do you know there is a way to know and understand how people lived in those days? So we are all small kids, so we don't know about how we have lived in the past days. So what she's telling, are you people and all that they are telling grandma and grandpa, you people and all living in a jolly way. But in a, okay, how can we know that the people lived in those days? So we can find out how the people lived in those days, we can easily, that is a way grandma is telling. How is that possible? Previous uh, past history, la, all the people lived in every country. How is it possible? Tell me more. She is asking. Have you ever found a seashell while uh, digging the beach? So when we are going to a beach, we have been seeing the so many shells will be there. So I am the manna tondi tondi and the kuti kuti shells, different types of shells we have been collecting. Yes, similarly, Ademari, there are people who dig the earth at various places. And the Marisilla people Zirkana Dukan and the studies Padichir Kronga. So they are known as the archaeologists. Those people who dig the earth at various places and find the things which are used by the people of the past. So and the Marisilla archaeologists in Apanwanga, they will dig the earth and find some of the things they have been used. Vessel so, either or now we use panada, they will take it and dig it and see that. 
these people are called archaeologists so and the people the archaeologists the process of digging the ground and the process dig pandranle that is known as the excavation okay so and the pallan thondrad and the mannai yerthu thondi and idu pandrad that is excavation and what all the dig the earth and various places ange edavad porul iruka previous da vaalnda manidargal use panna past people use panna porul iruka and paathu romba per archaeologist digging the earth the process of digging the earth is excavation now what do you mean by the excavation excavation is a controlled exploration of what lies under the surface of the earth so earth irukku sama earth konjam thondunaale if we dig the earth we will get the sand apra inna some of the places le thondu thondu some things they have been used previous man used controlled exploration adha control pannidru exploration adha kandupidikadu what is under the surface of the earth all forms of the archaeological excavation require great skills and careful preparation so ella adathiley poi idu vandu we cannot dig out and see this excavations we have to found the all forms of archaeological excavation requires a great skill now we go the kiradi and this place la they found out the things adha nu thondu bodu avangalukku kadaikal sila place in the place la kiradi la so they have find out the that artifacts and pair the porals la we are getting that uh, all the things under the earth that is known as the artifacts so they require a great skill and a careful preparation and excavations are classified based on the purpose like plant first they have to plant plan panni edukara sila excavations inda edathla irukku inda edathla and people irukanga solli plan panni they can go and take sometimes accidentally sila some of the land le avangalukke sometimes edavadhu oru porul kadaikum some idols edavadhu oru vessel illa adu pot or any vessel that is accidental and rescue vera edavadhu edukku pogum ivangalukku kadaikum so in this three way the excavations are classified most excavations and mostly excavations ellame properly pre-planned ellame munnadiye plan panni da ellam pannuvanga properly pre-planned and that purpose is to find buried evidences from the site and the mannoda podaindu pona buried uh, evidences and the தடயங்கள் என்னென்ன பொருள்கள் அந்த தடயங்களில் அந்த சைட்லேருந்து கிடைக்கும் ஸோ தே வில் பி ப்ரீ பிளான் ஸோ எக்ஸ்கவேஷன்னா அந்த இடத்த கண்டு இது இந்த இடத்துல அந்த பொருள் இருக்கா இல்லையான்னு கண்டுபிடிக்கிறதுக்கு தே வில் பி ப்ரீ பிளான் பிளான் பண்ணி தான் தே வில் டு கோ அந்த பர்பஸ் அவங்களுடைய முக்கியமான பர்பஸ் என்ன டு ஃபைண்ட் த பரீட் எவிடென்சஸ் மண்ணோட புதஞ்சு போன அந்த தடயங்கள் அந்த இடத்துல இருக்கு ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் இஸ் ஏ தே ஆர் கிவன் த பிக்சர் திஸ் இஸ் த எக்ஸ்கவேஷன் மண் தோன்றாங்க இல்லையா தோண்டி பார்க்கும்போது எது வேணால் கிடைக்கலாம் ஒரு அனிமல்ஸோட பார்ட்ஸ் கிடைக்கலாம் இல்லை வெசல்ஸு சிலைகள் ஐடல்ஸ் ஒரு எனி பார்ட்ஸ் காயின்ஸு ஸோ த ப்ரீவியஸ் இயர்ஸ் அண்ட் ஆல் த யூஸ் த காயின்ஸ் அவங்க யூஸ் பண்ண காயின்ஸ் இப்போ நம்ம யூஸ் பண்ண காயின்ஸ் வேறு அந்த காலத்தில் காப்பர் காயின்ஸ் யூஸ் ஆஃப் சம் ஆஃப் த காயின்ஸ் லைக் தட் ஆர்கியாலஜிஸ் அதை கொண்டு வந்து அவங்க ஆராய்ச்சி பண்ணி ரிசர்ச் பண்ணி அது எத்தனை வருஷம் ஆனது என்னென்ன ஃப்யூச்சர்ஸ்ன்றது தே வில் சே ஓகே ஸோ தட் இஸ் த ஆர்கியாலஜிஸ்ட் now the things that archaeologists find during the excavation the things that archaeologists and the research parangalia archaeologists find during the excavation sila porulgal anda edathla kadikirad illaya during excavation that is called and the idukku per da or called artifact what is that artifacts avanga thondu bodu kedaikira porulgal da artifacts okay archaeologists can tell a lot about the people so the archaeologists enna pannuvanga they research panni they can tell about the people who lived there by looking at the remains of their houses clothes bones and other artifacts so avanga you will find the iram உபயோகப்படுத்திய என்ன மாதிரியான கிளாத்ஸ் யூஸ் பண்ணாங்க அண்ட் போன்ஸ் அண்ட் அதர் ஆர்டிஃபேக்ட்ஸ் ஓகே ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் அபவுட் த ஆர்கியாலஜிஸ் அபவுட் த எக்ஸ்கவேஷன்ஸ் இன் த ஏன்ஷியன்ட் எக்ஸ்கவேஷன் நான் வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு சி அபவுட் ஹூ இஸ் அண்ட் ஆர்கியாலஜிஸ்ட் ஆர்கியாலஜிஸ்ட் மீன்ஸ் த பீப்புள் ஹூ ஸ்டடி த ஹிஸ்ட்ரி ஆஃப் ஹியூமன்ஸ்
the people who study the history of humans and places through excavation and analyze the artifacts are called <coughs> archaeologists so the people who study about the history of humans or manushangala pathi past history of the humans and the places our gal vaalnda idam through excavation excavation is by digging the earth and analyze the artifacts analyze the artifacts na avanga kedaikka koodiya porutkala vechi kanakkidudal analyze the artifacts are called archaeologists okay so excavation gives the glimpses of the past so and the pudai porul aarachin solvanga and excavation that gives the glimpses or kannotam or namalku theriyadhu theriya vekkadhu glimpses of the past is a archaeologist okay so archaeologists is the people who study the history of the humans and places through excavation and analyze the artifacts akadeitha porula vechi connect are called archaeologists these excavations gives the glimpses of the past so how the people lived in the past few years some interesting examples from the world not only in uh, tamil nadu but also in all over the <coughs> world what are the interesting facts <coughs> pyramids in egypt what is that pyramids in egypt pyramids in egypt so this is also one of the interesting facts of the world idle enna interesting facts irukume sabin kettinga you know the pyramids when the pyramids were excavated it was found that small pyramids are made for the queens chinna chinna queens small small pyramids this is the pyramids in egypt okay and indus civilization excavation so when the pyramids were excavated it was found that small pyramids were made for the queens they found huge tombs with the super structures which are built for the burial of the royal family skeletons found in the pyramid gave information about the average height and the age of the people so when the pyramids irkumode they have the small pyramids were only for the queens are they built or they found a huge tomb or a periya box mari irkum tombs kumb and super structures which are built for the burial this is the tomb this is the tomb of the super structure of the tomb and which so which are built for the burial of the only for the royal family members they will build the burial like this and then and inside that the skeletons are where the kapra it will be only as a skeletons so skeletons found in the pyramid gave information about the average age so on the skeleton edith after the excavation they will took out the skeleton and found the average height and the age of the people and another one is indus civilization in this indus civilization is also called harappan civilization so indus civilization is also called harappan civilization harappan harappan civilization this was the first site to be excavated in the early 20th century so in this uh, civilization is also no harappan civilization so they built the houses like this and they lived and spent their life life there only so this is the first site in the site the first they have excavated it and avanga vandha aarachi ki first first they are digging the earth in the early 20th century baked bricks were found underground so avanga thondum bodhu avangalukku enna kadichiduna baked bricks adavadhu bricks na sengal sengal vandu adha bake panni adha vandu enna solvanga adha sengal soolaiyila vechi adha bake pannite and then the veer kattradhu pan so they have found the baked bricks are found underground and the city had a well planned houses so over city adha eppadi build panna ellame plan panni perfect ah they planned houses with wells canal and proper drainage system also that uh, put all the rubbish and all we have to put at the drainage system is all properly done and that provide a way to direct waste water to closed drains so direct a waste water inge in the beat lend direct and the closed drains kitta poi matta waters le edum kalakama properly they have planned everything very well so this only they have found in the indus civilization and it was found that a city and its civilization 
வேர் வெரி அட்வான்ஸ் ஃபார் த டைம் ஸோ அந்த இண்டர் சிவிலைசேஷன் அந்த ப்ரீவியஸாக இருக்கிறத விட ஆஃப்டர் தட் டெவலப் தே ஃபவுண்ட் தட் அ சிட்டி இன் சிவிலைசேஷன் அட்வான்ஸ் ரொம்ப அட்வான்ஸ்டு தே ஆவ் டெவலப்ட் அண்ட் சம் இன்ட்ரெஸ்டிங் எக்ஸாம்பிள்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் தமிழ்நாடு வாட் ஆர் சம் இன்ட்ரெஸ்டிங் எக்ஸாம்பிள்ஸ் தேர் ஆர் மெனி பிளேசஸ் இன் தமிழ்நாடு ஆல்சோ வி ஆர் ஃபைன் த எக்ஸ்கவேஷன்ஸ் வாட் ஆர் த எக்ஸ்கவேஷன்ஸ் ஆதிச்சநல்லூர் தென் அரிக்கமேடு கீழடி ஸோ தீஸ் ஆர் த எக்ஸ்கவேஷன்ஸ் இந்த இடத்துலலாம் நம்மளுக்கு எவ்ரி திங் தே ஆர் ஃபார்ம் தட் இஸ் சம் ஆஃப் த எக்ஸ்கவேஷன் ஸோ ஃபஸ்ட் ஒன் இஸ் ஆதிச்சநல்லூர் ஆதிச்சநல்லூரில் என்ன இருக்கு ஆதிச்சநல்லூர் இஸ் இன் தூத்துக்குடி டிஸ்ட்ரிக்ட் ஸோ த ஆர்டிஃபேக்ட்ஸ் அன்னத்துட்டு வர் அவங்க என்னென்ன திக் பண்ணும்போது கிடைச்சதுன்னா ஏர்ன்ஸ் பாட்டரி ஆஃப் வேரியஸ் காயின்ஸ் ஆஃப் ரெட் பேர் அண்ட் பிளாக் பேர் பாட்டரினா பாத்திரங்கள் மண் பாண்டங்கள் ஸோ ரெட் பேர் ஆஸ் வெல் அஸ் த பிளாக் ரெட் பெயிண்டர் மாதிரி இது பிளாக் பெயிண்டர் அண்ட் அயன் இம்ப்ளிமெண்ட்ஸ் இரும்பு ச பொருட்கள் டேக்கஸ் ஸ்வாட்ஸ் ஸ்பியர்ஸ் அண்ட் ஆரோஸ் அண்ட் சம் ஸ்டோன் பீட்ஸ் அண்ட் எ ஃபியூ கோல்டு ஆர்னமெண்ட்ஸ் bronze objects representing the domestic and wild animals like tiger antelope and elephant have been unearthed the artifacts prove that people were skillful in making pottery and in working in stone and wood so we have some interesting pieces so what you have seen so far in this excavation we have seen about the what do you mean by the excavation that is the digging the earth to see the what is under the ground and who will do this excavation only the archaeologists who is an archaeologist the people who dig the earth at various places and find things which are used in the past people so excavations are based on the planned accidental or rescue and most of the excavations they do panvanga mostly they will be properly pre planned and their purpose is to find the buried evidence so ange enna porul irukko that only they will take so the things that the archaeologists find during the excavation on garage par dig pannum bodu some things they will get that is known as the artifacts and the archaeologists what they will say they tell a lot about the people or the habits they lay the remains of their houses clothes and bones and other facts and some interesting examples is pyramids in egypt and indus civilization so from this paper we can find out able to see that they well improved and in indus civilization is the first site to be excavated in the 20th century how we are known that means baked bricks are found and city as well planned and they have uh, planned houses they built the houses with the planned and uh, proper drainage system is there and wells also is there and they provide a direct waste water to the closed drains and there were advanced granaries great bath and protective walls it was found that the city and its civilization were very advanced for that time so on the 20th century most of the time when the people they have developed and they were advanced for the previous years okay children thank you we will see in the next class